Nord VPN review. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'll be reviewing this amazing tool called NordVPN. It allows you to stream across different countries, browse safely, be assured with a no lock policy, and so much more. Hopefully, by the end of this video, you'll learn everything you need to know about NordVPN. Now, if you're looking to get started with NordVPN without my personal link, the best deal that you can get is a monthly subscription for $12.99 per month. However, by clicking my personal link down below, you'll be able to go down from $12.99 per month all the way only to $3.08 per month. Meaning, by using my personal link, you'll be able to save $240 on a two-year period. That's $10 that you save every month by using my code 5VHTECH, which is automatically applied if you click my link down below. Now, let's get started. The first thing you need to know is a little about the policies and jurisdiction of NordVPN. So, NordVPN has a transparent privacy policy. If you take a look at some of their independent researches, they promise not to collect logs and there have been plenty of independent audits to prove this. Even when a server was breached in Finland in 2018, there were no user credentials that were exposed. Following this incident, NordVPN terminated their contract with their server and invited Versprite to run an audit to spot any weaknesses and fix potential harm. NordVPN also operate RAM-only servers, which means that there are no physical hard drives that are linked to the servers. So with all these security features that NordVPN provides to its users, it's totally worth a shot. Now, some people might wonder, is this going to be helpful for me because I like to keep my internet fast and using a VPN is going to reduce my speed. Well, even if your internet speed drops by 50%, you can still connect to servers on the other side of the globe using NordVPN. In NordVPN's recent VPN protocol called NordLynx. So if you go into your overview section, you will see your web protection, your file protection, your settings. Then you also have some basic overviews. You have your dark web monitors, overviews, and statistics. And then if you go into your general settings over here, you will be able to see your VPN protocol, which we are using NordLynx. In NordLynx, the VPN protocol actually saves speed and maintains a range of 10 to 25%. So speed drops will be maintained and will only have a 10 to 25% range, thus making NordVPN the fastest VPN in the industry. Even when gaming, your ping will remain low as long as you're connected to the VPN server that's closest to the game server. And in terms of streaming, you can choose any server without compromise to unlock any kind of content that you want. So you don't have to wait for geo restrictions to be lifted in your country. You also have access to peer-to-peer, -peer, especially servers where torrenting actually is optimized. And this works well for streaming platforms as well. You can go into your general globe and then you can scroll down and you also have speciality servers. Now, NordVPN also has a smart play feature that allows you to use any server while keeping you secure, not just Netflix, but also platforms like Disney, Hulu, and Amazon Prime. Now, NordVPN has a lot of great security features and advanced options. Protocols such as the Nord Links, and OpenVPN are definitely going to go hand in hand. NordLynx is for users that want the fastest connection possible. OpenVPN is more stable, however, can compromise speed. So depending on what you're doing at the time, you can use the suggested protocol. NordVPN also has a kill switch, which is great for security purposes. It allows users to disable their internet connection if their VPN stops working. This is to avoid unprotected traffic from leaking out your data, and the kill switch feature should always stay on on your NordVPN. Now, split tunneling is also a great security setting, and this allows you to select certain apps to work with a VPN and vice versa. For example, you can configure a torrent software to only launch when a VPN is connected. 
although this feature is currently not available on Mac and iOS. Users do have the option to customize their DNS and use their speciality servers like dedicated IP, obfuscated servers, and Onion over VPN and P2P servers. Now, there are some bonus features of NordVPN, including threat protection. This allows you to function as a basic malware or ad blocker, and this blocks ads, trackers, and secures your device from harmful files like an antivirus. Now, other bonus features include MeshNet, which can be used to create a multiple level of protection for your PC. Now, you can also use the MeshNet feature if you're using your out of the country and you want to appear like you're using your devices at home. NordVPN is constantly updating and improvising MeshNet while being completely free. Yes, you don't need to subscribe to a paid NordVPN account just to get the MeshNet feature. Another feature is their dark web monitor. It will keep an eye out for your data to prevent it from being leaked in the dark web. NordVPN will also notify you in case your data has been breached, so you can take the appropriate measures to resecure your data. Now, the compatibility of NordVPN across multiple different devices is astonishing because there are over 5,000 servers worldwide in over 60 countries of NordVPN. To some, 60 countries may not be a lot, but you'll find it easy to connect to a server no matter where you are. If you're in China, make sure to turn on the kill switch protocol, selection is set to auto, and you're using your obfuscated server. The reason for this is because you're going to get the best out of your NordVPN connection and features. NordVPN also works on all kinds of devices, including streaming sticks and smart TVs. And the best part about using NordVPN is that you can actually use it to connect to upwards of six devices all at once. So. I don't have to subscribe to multiple different accounts. I don't have to create multiple different accounts just to be able to use it on my phone, as well as my laptop, my desktop, my tablet, my smart TV, or any other device that I'm using. Now, if you want to connect to the fastest possible server and you're only looking for a surface level protection from your VPN, then you can go into the globe and you can scroll down and you will see multiple different options or you can just click on the top right icon and click on quick connect. With quick connect, it will connect you to the fastest possible server. And once you are connected to the fastest possible server, you will be able to get the fastest possible speed. And if you're looking for the quick connect option in a particular country, you can connect to the server of that country and then you can go into the quick connect of that particular country. So you can go into South Korea and then go into the quick connect over there. So if I go into Australia like this, I can click on the right dots and then click on quick connect to be able to find the fastest server present in Australia. And this is going to help you in getting the country that you desire on your server and you will be able to get the preferred nation and the preferred geo content restrictions lifted while still being able to get the fastest speed possible. Now, I have a lot of benefits of NordVPN, especially when I was gaming and I wasn't really certain of whether or not I should be using my own IP address because those games can leak data to a lot of different companies. And I was using NordVPN, where I actually found that even when using NordVPN, I never noticed a difference in terms of speed or the quality of my game, which a lot of people complain that if they ever use a VPN while they are gaming, they feel like their gaming performance lowered simply because of their higher pings and a more unstable connection. However, NordVPN has a great design and interface. Their features are optimized for use and you can choose the preferred setting that you want with NordVPN simply by going into their settings and you can check the preferred protocol that you want. You also have some appearance features where you can make it in the dark version. You can add a menu bar as well. And all of these features can help you in making sure that you have a simple and easy to use tool that is serving you instead of you having to run around behind your particular tool. Now, it is compatible on all devices and its security is top notch. However, one con of NordVPN that I still find to be pretty disappointing is split tunneling because this is still not available on Mac and iOS devices. 
and keep in mind that the kill switch option which i prefer to keep on anyways most of the times is not available on ios devices so turning it off is not available the kill switch is present on ios however you can't really turn it off so it will always remain on on top of it getting a nordvpn is going to be worth it other than these two compromises, you're getting the best speeds possible, you're getting the newest VPN protocol, and not only can you scream across different regions, you can also browse safely with great speed, no logs policies, and this is going to be ideal for torrenting because you have Quick Connect which will add you to the fastest possible server. So NordVPN is a very beginner friendly and at the same time has advanced features as well. You can click my personal link in the description down below. Without my personal link, the best deal you can get is a monthly subscription for $12.99 per month. But clicking my personal link down below, you'll be able to go down to $12.99 per month all the way only to $3.08 per month, meaning that using my link will help you save $240 on a two-year period. And that's $10 you save every month by using our code 5VHTECH, which is automatically applied if you click my link down below. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I will catch you in the next video.